Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing another trying world record scramble videos. I really like doing these. I think they're a lot of fun. We actually do have one new world record to try, so that is very cool. Let's get started. So I've never actually seen a 3x3 world record in person, but there have been a few comps where 3x3 world records happen that I could have gone to. The first is Colin Burns 5.25. I decided not to go to that comp even though it was literally the closest comp to my house ever at that time because I had to go to softball picture day instead and then I missed out on getting to see a world record. So the first scramble I'm going to be trying is the scramble from that world record. I've never tried it before so we'll see how it goes. I'm pretty sure he did white. I do not do white. I only do green. So I guess on my first attempt, I'll just do green. Oh, I messed up. Oh no, I messed up worse that time. Whoa, okay. That definitely was not the same solution he had at all, but I found a solution with a PL skip using green cross. 668. All right, that is, that is very good. That is great for me. I'm super happy with that. Now I'm gonna try it with white cross and we'll see if I can find the right solution. I doubt I can, but who knows. No, I definitely did not find the right solution on that. And of course, I'm just not that good with white cross. I would say I am a little better after my week being color neutral, but still not too great. So that is all for that scramble. I'm actually pretty happy with how I did. The next scramble we're going to be trying is Lucas Edder's 490, which is actually another world record that I nearly saw in person, I guess, because that comp is fairly close to my house, but I was actually at a different comp. They were pretty much equally far from my house, but I guess I just chose the other one. But I remember this day, I remember being at a different comp and like hearing about all the craziness that was going on at River Hill that day. But I've never tried the scramble before either, so yep, let's see. All right, so I just watched the video and it looked like he did white cross as well. So I guess I'll start with green, see how it goes, and then I'll try to find the correct solution on white. No, that actually could have been good, but I messed up. Okay, that is not working out so well with green cross, so now I'm going to try it with white cross. Ooh, okay, I actually did like the same as I did with green, so that's pretty good. I definitely think that I could have done better, so I'm going to try it one more time. Okay, one more time. <laughs> Okay, I actually did better with white than I did on green, so maybe my color neutral practice did pay off a little. Not anything close to world record, but I think this is as good as it's getting for this scramble. So now we are going to move on to the next event. All right, so next I'm going to be doing 4x4. I don't think I've tried any 4x4 world record scrambles before, so this will be my first one. I really doubt I'm going to find the correct solution for this. So this is the current 4x4 world record single 17.42 by Sebastian Weyer. Here we go. That was pretty bad. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, that was pretty consistently bad. I don't think I'm gonna get anything too good on that. There's absolutely no way I like found the correct solution or anything, so. All right, so for the final event, I'm going to be doing more square one. I feel like I always do 
so bad in for square one in these videos which is always surprising because i always feel like i'm gonna do so good because like you know the scrambles are super easy but i don't know why i always like do really bad so maybe today things will be different so the scramble i'm going to be doing is the 4.59 by martin Egdal. so this is actually like the only world record that's been set since the last time i tried current world record scramble so that's pretty exciting i've never tried this before This is like such a bad cube shape, or at least I think it is. That was terrible. Why do I always do square one so bad? Okay, um, wow. I don't know like CSP or anything, so I couldn't like avoid parody so i got parody and yeah that was just pretty bad for the last scramble i'm going to be trying daniel carnell's former world record single 5.49 i have never tried this scramble either so yeah maybe i will finally get a decent square one solve on one of these videos oh see this is a nice scramble Okay, that is semi-official PB, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's definitely semi-official PB. Okay, I'm happy with that. Finally, I did decent on one of these square one solves. That was a pretty nice scrub. I definitely think I could do better though. Ooh, okay, a little bit better. Ooh, okay. I mean, I pretty much already like memorized the solution this time, but my execution was better, I guess. So, all right. Yeah, I'm proud of that. I finally actually did decent on square one scramble. I feel like I always like get parody or just get like, just can't find a decent solution. But this time, I'm pretty sure I found the correct solution. It was at least the same cube shape. Pretty sure. So anyway, that is all for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.